fish. Swim and get me out on the fish, huh? Hey, let's get Dan over here. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, rubber bands, we're pretty crazy. Yeah. Well, let's start off with a bang. I've got some really interesting news that I read in the newspaper this morning. Did you ever notice how, if you're a middle-aged woman, someone could easily hold a conversation with you simply by eating a midnight snack? Yeah. Midnight snack. In fact, a lot of people didn't believe me because I was a big fat liar with my pants on fire. So I'm going to get this phone out here real quick, along with a midnight snack, Christmas cookies to be exact, an American classic. I'm going to call Edna right now, and we're going to hold a complete conversation simply by eating a midnight snack, okay? So let's get Edna on the phone, guys, so I can prove to my member audience... Right, right. <laughs> I'm doing is eating the next snack, right? Right? Edna! <laughs> Hello? Well, I haven't seen you in a while. Oh my gosh, is this Jonathan? How are you doing? Oh, poop me! Oh, I know how you feel. Let's just say I haven't had the most peaceful weekend, if you know what I mean. Oh. Oh, yeah. Well, first of all, my stove broke the day before Piano Study Club was coming over for a luncheon. Mm. Oh, that was just the start. Well, it was obvious there'd be no way I could fix the casserole now. I'd have to start completely from scratch. Absolutely unbelievable. That's what I said. I walked over to Babs to borrow some sugar for the dessert, and as we were walking into the kitchen, she fell on her bad knee, and she didn't even knock it out of socket. Oh, wow. Isn't that incredible? This is always such a treat. Oh, well, thank you, but I've really got to go now. The kids are coming home from school. But I always like this. Song. I know. Well, hey, maybe till next Me time. Me neither. Talk to you then. Bye-bye. Okay. See what I mean? Easy as pie. Or maybe even a cookie. <laughs> well, let's get straight to business tonight and get to some incredible guests that have extreme talent in the area of the arts. I mean, that's what we're doing here, right? So why would I eat cookies when I could bring them right to you? And hey, Dan's pretty excited about that, aren't you, bud? I'm excited. Uh, he's the best in the West, isn't he? So let's go ahead and take a little time to really get to know Dan a little better. Because, you know, he sits back there by himself all the time. Tell us your favorite color, maybe your favorite popsicle flavor. Uh, purple. Really? Mm. Uh, I don't know how much I like purple, but if you like purple, I guess I can chill with it. <laughs> well, guys, before we learn a little more about Dan, why don't we learn a little more about our student audience members? We're going to get right back with you. Films and Books by Jonathan Pierce. Download one today at thinkpierce.com. 